There will never be peace in the Ileife Palace. As long as the Oloris in there keep on fighting with one another, as long as they keep on creating problems for themselves, then there is no space for peace at all. Because these things that they are doing, the things that they are exhibiting right now, the type of character they are exhibiting can actually lead them in trouble, can put them in a whole different trouble. But they still feel like this is the perfect time for them to react. This is the perfect time to get onto Queen Naomi. This is the perfect time for them to actually get on Queen Naomi's nerves so that she can't come back into the palace again. So guys, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on when and where you are actually watching us from. This is Royal Update TV, where we we'll bring you top cheese from the entertainment industry and also from the Oni of Ife Palace. Olori Ronke has made up her mind that no matter what is happening, no matter what the case may be, that if Olori Elizabeth is planning on supporting Queen Naomi, then of course, she can be willing to continue. But she won't guarantee Olori Elizabeth a safe life ahead. She won't guarantee her anything at all. She is not going to guarantee Olori Elizabeth peace inside of the palace of Ileife. Say, stating that no matter how bad it may look, no matter what exactly may happen, she is ready to attack Olori Elizabeth fire for fire. She is ready to attack anybody that tries to come in her way. Because she knows she doesn't want Queen Naomi inside of the palace of Ileife. And she has realized that Olori Elizabeth has been the one, has been the pioneer of her coming back into the palace. And she has noticed that Olori Elizabeth will be willing to spoil her plans. Olori Elizabeth will be willing to spoil the plans that she has for Queen Naomi. That is why she has come out right now. She has made that statement stating that if at all, Olori Elizabeth is planning on doing the unthinkable. Olori Elizabeth is planning on doing the unthinkable. Then of course, this is the time for her to come out now so that they can battle it. So that they can go one on one. So we can know what is going on. So we will know who is boss inside of the palace. We will know who is more valuable inside of the palace of Ileife because she is planning everything she can. She is planning every single thing she can. As long as it is not bringing Queen, as long as Queen Naomi isn't coming back into the palace, then she is happy with that alongside Olori Miriam. But on a normal circumstance, I see no reason why a fellow woman would be against her own fellow woman. Like, where is the, all of this feeling coming from? Where exactly is everything coming from? If I thought you guys are looking for a way to pick up a fight, you shouldn't do it in front of Oni. You shouldn't even dare involve Queen Naomi at all. Maintain the position that you have. Maintain that position because that is the only thing that can save you. That is the only thing that can save you from all of this horror you are passing through. That is the only single thing that can save you. So if you continue you continue behaving like, yes, I know what I am doing. I know this and know that. Then that is when things will start to go in another different dimension for you. Because Queen Naomi has people, whether she's inside the palace or outside of the palace, that is going to be at her back no matter the situation. So guys, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And don't forget to drop your comment down at the comment section.